So, good morning everyone. So, we are now on module number 10 of Mathematics 7, lesson number 2. So, solving problems involving real numbers. So, how to solve word problems involving real numbers. So, first is we're going to identify what are the parts of answering a um, word problem in mathematics. First, we must identify the given. We must know what to find and and show our solution if we if we know the solution, including the formula. And lastly is the conclusion. Uh, what is this conclusion all about? That is the answer to what to find. For example, the question is what are uh, what are the difference of the two products? Therefore, you can say therefore the two the difference of the two products are or is. <clears throat> so next, let's have an example to that. So, there are 8 packs of fruit juice in a box. How many boxes needed if 40 people are attending the meeting with each receiving 6 packs of fruit juice? So, there are 8 packs of fruit juice in a box. So, that is our given now. So, we write our given. We write our given. So, we have given. So, there are 8 packs of fruit juice. So, what is this 8 packs of fruit juice in a box? So, again, meron daw lamang 8 packs. 8 packs could be more than 1 sa isang pack. Tama? And how many boxes needed if 40 people are attending the meeting with each receiving 6 packs of fruit juice? So, Ano po yung sinasabi niya dito? So, let us have the module for our... <clears throat> yung given po natin is 8 packs of fruit juice in a box for 40 people and each person will be receiving 6 packs. Yan po yung given natin. So, you, you may write... So, we are, we are going to have um, 8 packs of fruit juice. 8 packs of fruit juice juice for how many people for 40 people for 40 people and that 40 people must have six packs each so and each person and each person must have six packs of it must have six So, yan po yung given natin. Yung 8 packs of fruit juice for 40 people at kada taon daw, meron dapat silang 6 packs each. So, what are we going to find here? So, um, usually, what are we going to find and ended with a question. So, attending the meeting with each 6 different packs of juice. How many boxes? So, we are asked to how many boxes. So, what are we going to find is the number of boxes. So, we are going to find the number of boxes of juice needed. So, this is our what are we going to find or what to find. And the next, last, uh, the third part is the solution. So, if there are 40 people to attend solution if there are 40 people to attend, each must have six, um, each must carry six uh, fruit juice times six. Then, um, kailangan nakalagay ito sa eight boxes. Tama? So, we are going to divide it by eight. So, that is how to answer this one. So, 40 times six. So, 40 times 40, 40 times 6, we have 6 times 0, 4 times 6, 12 plus 12, 24, 240. 240 divided by 8, so we have 240 divided by 8, 240 divided by 8, allow me to use this as scratch. So we have 3 times 8, 24, 0, 0, that is 30. So, our answer here is 30. 30 nga ba? So, 
Let's check, double check with our module. The answer here is 30. So that is how to answer that one. So solution, conclusion. If you're done with solution, we go with conclusion. So ang find natin kanina, so the number of boxes, therefore, therefore, 30 number or 30 boxes are needed. 30 boxes are needed. Needed. So, that is now our answer. So, let us have example number 2. So, Lucas added 3 forks of a bag of soil to his garden while Matthew added 6 fifths bags of soil in his garden. How much more soil did Matthew add than Lucas? This is a problem of comparison. So, <clears throat> gano'n daw kadami yung dinagdag ni Matthew or ni Lucas sa kanilang soil na nilagay. So, the given here as is the three-fourths, uh, three-fourths of bag of soil for Lucas. So, we have Lucas, three-fourths bags of soil. That is for Lucas. Next, for Matthew, for Matthew, um, he added six fifths bags of soil in his garden. So, we have six fifths bags of soil. Allow me to use the symbol, meaning copy. And what do I need to find is the bag of soil of Matthew added to Lucas, or added than Lucas, rather. So, we are going to find the bag of soil. I think the answer the amount of bag of soil Matthew added uh, Matthew the bag of soil Matthew added than Lucas added than Lucas So it's just simple we're just going to subtract the entire um 3 fourths minus 6 fifths so solution so we have the solution. Three fourths minus six fifths. So in this case, we are going to use LCD. Four times five, that is twenty. Twenty divided by four, that is five times three, fifteen. Twenty divided by five, that is four times six, that is. 30. So, minus 15 minus 30, we have 15 over 20, negative. So, we have negative 3 over 4. So, so, since there is no negative, um, negative, uh, what is this? Negative solution to a land, Alangan nag-add ka ng negative na soil. Therefore, you, we make it an absolute value. So, the absolute value of 3 fourth is equal to 3 over 4. So, the answer is 3 over 4. Let us see if we have the same answer with 9 over 20. So, mali tayo class. Bakit kaya? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Nabaliktad ko. So, the solution is like this, 6 over 5 minus 3 over 4, then 20 ang IELTS LCD. 20 divided by 5, that is 4 times 6, is 4 times 6, 12, 24. 20 divided, four, divided by 4, that is 5 times 6, is 15. 24 minus 15, that is 9 over 20. So, the answer is 9 over 20. Sorry for this class. Correct naman. So, we have 9 over 20 as our answer to this. So, our conclusion here is... So, conclusion. Therefore, uh, we need... Uh, Lucas needed... Uh, uh, Matthew added 920. So, Matthew added 9 over 20. Um more bags of soil. So, more bags of soil to Dan Lucas to his garden.
So, that is how to answer this one. So, thank you for watching for this lesson number 2 of module number 10.